stay feet, are you jealous or no? Are you jealous or no? She walked over there just as bald as can be. <laughs> but hey, y'all, welcome back to another review of Life of Chester for the Bold and Beautiful May 1st, 2024. Okay, y'all. So I said, look at Steffi. Look at Steffi. The man was trying to talk to her. She's so focused on them. Then to my son, she, she said she'll find Deacon later. I said, I bet you will. Then walked over there to my son. My cousin is in town and she didn't bother to tell me. Did you come all the way over here to plant one on Liam? I said, girl. I said, don't worry. He still wants you and she's not going to be in town long enough. Now, she was staying because she keeps saying how she got to go. But she did say she delayed her. Then she delayed her flight. But yeah, I'm ready to see what Steffi says, though. Okay, so we might as well start there with Liam, Ivy, Ridge, and Steffi. So Steffi was still worried about Finn and what he's dealing with, and she loves, she just sick of Deacon. Ridge doesn't understand why Finn listening to Deacon. And he said, Deacon an idiot. I said, he keep on name calling folks and stuff. But he said, Deacon an idiot, he don't understand why Finn listening to him. I said, how you gonna feel when you find out she was still alive? I wanna know if Sheila was involved in all this. Was this her and Sugar's plan? Because according to Lauren, they was in cahoots together before. She over here, Steffi, 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 and all that. I said, did you have something to do with it? Look, we supposed to be talking about Steffi now first. <laughs> but they wasn't talking about nothing. Just she's worried about Finn. All that concern left once she seen them two kisses. Talking about she'll find him later. I said, I bet you will. But she ended up telling Ridge that she was going to go basically confront Deacon again and tell him to drop this about Sheila being alive. I said, they need to go on. This is one of the days that they should go ahead, let everybody find out. Because y'all know how we'll be waiting on them to finish a scene and they never do. Now they want to delay it and take their precious time. But on today's episode, they finally got the chain off Sheila and they was talking to her and just giving her something to drink and trying to get her to talk and speak and everything. She was happy to see Finn. Deacon talking to her. He happy. Finn happy. I said, Finn. I said, Finn, Finn, Finn. This going to be something. He ended up, what did he tell her? He was basically saying how he happy he get another chance and he glad she's still alive. But well, Sheila started crying, telling them about Steffi and Sugar's plan, and she went there to harm her. I said, I don't know. I couldn't tell if she knew about it or what. I guess we're going to find out one of these days if she actually was involved or whatever. I wonder if they're going to try to spin it like Sugar was trying to sabotage Sheila and make it seem like Sheila was the one who went out to Steffi and had her arrested. But they ended up telling her that everybody's fine, the kids are fine, Steffi's fine. And Finn hugs Sheila. I said, oh my goodness, this finna be a mess. This finna be a mess. Then you go over here to Liam and Ivy and Steffi, because she came in at the end. So, Ivy laying it on a little thick. She over here doing what Steffi did. And who else was that? Bill. Talking about son, he okay just the way he is. And they, they was lucky to have you and all this other stuff. I said, really? I said, really? So, they kept kissing. She kept kissing him and telling him how she feels. She never forgot about him and the times they shared. They actually gave us a little flashback. I was hoping because I forgot about a lot of that stuff. And then Steffi ends up coming in, and she was talking to, I guess there was a server or something, and this girl told him she'll find Deacon later. Went over there. Did y'all catch how she walked over there? Just as bothered. That's why I said she was just as bothered as bothered can be. She told me, I said, my cousin is in town. I said, you don't eat like that girl. I bet you don't like that girl. <laughs> she, my cousin is in town, and she didn't think to call. When the last time you talked to her? When the last time? Tell me, I said, did you come all the way over here just to plant one on Liam? I said, uh-uh. Also, I know what I was going to say about Ivy. I said, Ivy, you wasting your time. You wasting your time. And she said something about she basically giving him something to think about. I said, what you want from him? I said, wait a minute. I said, what you think going to happen? He's going to choose Steffi. Right now, he on Steffi. Next week, he going to be on Hope. <laughs> Not actually next week, but y'all know what I'm saying. But yeah, I said, Steffi, don't worry. He still wants you. And once you find out she was still alive and Finn going to want something to do with her, or he going to have something to do with her now, we at a place now where he's definitely going to have something to do with her. But yeah, what did y'all think of today's episode? Let me know down below. Stay tuned for the next review. Until next time, deuces. Have a great rest of the day and be safe.